So Nick, this is uh, your number eight for your Panathinaikos. Uh, what uh, should we expect from uh, the experience right now, Nick? And what uh, should we expect from, in, from the team in general? Uh, hopefully a good picture on the court. Um, for us, uh, we want to win games. Uh, we want to start off strong uh, with our schedule. And um, for me, just to, to do what I do, um, you know, lead the team uh, in the best possibility that I can and uh, hopefully help to win games. Uh, last year, shooting was the major problem uh, of the team. Uh, maybe the, ma the main reason Panathinaikos didn't manage to qualify to, uh, to win uh, in uh, Madrid. Uh, what about this year? you feel it's going to be the strength uh, of the team? Uh, we got some new guys, a lot of shooters um, that can make shots. Uh, I feel like it's going to be a, a key part to our team to be able to shoot the ball. I don't believe that was the reason why we lost last year. Um, but this year we have a, a whole new roster, basically, and uh, our biggest, one of our biggest strengths is shooting, for sure. Uh, are you ready to justify Coach Pitino concerning his comments uh, that you could leverage double digit in assists with so many good shooters uh, around you? Uh, I think it'll be easy for me to, to obviously get assist, but um, for me, it's, uh, hopefully we can win games. That's the big thing. Uh, what about this year? Uh, what's the goal of the team? For me right now is just to, just to play basketball, to, to be good as a team, to get better each and every uh, step of the way because it's a long season. Uh, stay healthy and um, we will see what happens at the end. Um, every year I say Final Four, EuroLeague, uh, let's, just, let's just play good basketball and then at the end we'll see uh, where it takes us. You feel right now that you're carrying uh, lots of uh, responsibilities, that's because you're the leader of uh, Panathinaikos and the captain. Deep inside you, uh, is there any must uh, do it and make you feel a little bit anxious maybe? Uh, obviously you have that, um, that, I wouldn't say pressure, but the the nerves, the whatever to, to get to the Final Four. It's been, you know, uh, four years since I've been here that we haven't, or five years that we haven't got there. So it's time uh, to be able to actually do it. And um, obviously it's on my mind. Uh, it's something that I want to do. Uh, and obviously the club wants to do. And um, hopefully we can try to accomplish that. Mm -hmm. uh, you haven't had to, the opportunity to go to be with Coach Pedulac more than five, six uh, months. Uh, what do you think of him and what he wants from you? Uh, he's a, a very good coach. He knows basketball. Um, I think he wants, um, he has a lot of rules of what he expects as a team. Uh, for me, he wants me obviously to be the leader on the court, um, to be able to control the team when, if we're doing, uh, if we're going too fast, if we're going too slow. There's no doubt that uh, this year Euroleague is the most exciting, maybe more yes. teams, uh, for sure. good signings, uh, all the teams. Um, which team think is going to be the surprise of the Euroleague and uh, which team do you think is going to go much more further than uh, last year? Obviously, like you said, there's uh, a lot of teams that got new guys. It's, a, it's probably one of the most exciting Euroleague seasons uh, in a long time. Uh, for me, I'm not really paying attention to um, the other teams. Uh, you know, there's going to be teams that will do well and they got a lot of new guys. But uh, right now I'm just focused on us and hopefully uh, being able to compete with these other teams. Who you miss uh, Jeff Gist? Oh, for sure. Uh, me and him had a chemistry that uh, I probably won't see uh, in my career. Uh, the chemistry that we had, um, the feel that we had with each other on the court. And uh, he will definitely be missed. Uh, and obviously I'll be rooting for him. Uh, obviously not against us, but uh, any, other, any, any other games, uh, I'll be rooting for him to, to play well and do well. Uh, you have any message to him uh, for the upcoming game of your league? Uh, we talk uh, all the time and um, it'll be an exciting game. Uh, obviously, he'll be welcomed with our fans yes. uh, for what he's done uh, for this club. And uh, I'm excited to see him and play against him.